During a power cut in the TARDIS caused by temporal phenomena, Nyssa was sent to 1867 London by a death wraith but was soon reunited with the doctor, who had arrived in the TARDIS 12 months earlier. She was kidnapped from 107 Baker Street by Thomas Brewster, who stole the TARDIS key that the doctor had given her and left in the ship, leaving Nyssa and the doctor stranded until they were able to find a version of the TARDIS from an alternative timeline created by the wraith. After averting said timeline and removing Brewster's psychic link, Brewster stole the TARDIS a second time. Audio. The Haunting of Thomas Brewster. Nyssa and the Doctor were stranded on Earth for five months before they tried to use block transfer computation to bring back the TARDIS, an attempt which transported Nyssa to the City of Excellence where she encountered an aged Adric. She rebuffed him, denying having loved him and refusing to become his bride, but Adric ended up joining her and the Doctor and ended his plans for revenge. Returned to 1868, Nyssa mourned Adric when he died once more and returned to the TARDIS after he helped Brewster pilot it back to them. Audio. The boy that time forgot. Although Nyssa initially believed that she and the doctor had merely got themselves lost in the TARDIS, they learned that Brewster had sold some of the ship's parts, including the conceptual geometer. The doctor traced the parts to a time reef where Nyssa and Brewster saved a rook and the removed instruments were recovered from Commander Gamides, allowing them to restore the TARDIS. Audio. Time reef. Per Brewster's request, the doctor piloted the TARDIS to 2008. Nyssa believed that Brewster might have changed time to bring about a utopia. A suggestion that the doctor gave no credit as he could not believe that any alteration to the timeline could bring about such universally benign effects. When they learned that reality had been altered by Phil and Trev, Nyssa asked them if they could put things right, after which she was surprised by Brewster's decision to remain in 2008 with Connie Winter. Audio, A Perfect World. 